hello and welcome back to this channel once again as we prepare ourselves towards the upcoming of the core mathematics paper we are going to solve questions on ratio and proportion now we have our first question which is in object 2003 question 11b let's solve this question an aeroplane leaves barcelona at 10 10 pm and then reaches accra 4415 kilometers away at 5.50 a.m. the next morning. Find correct to the nearest whole number the average speed of the aeroplane in kilometers per hour. So this is a very simple problem. Let's try to solve this problem. So from the question, we are told that an aeroplane leaves Barcelona at 10.10 p.m. and then reaches Accra 4,415 kilometers away at 5.50 a.m. the next morning. So the distance between the two cities is 4,415 kilometers and that is the distance traveled by the aeroplane. So we say that the total distance covered is 4,415 kilometers next we are going to calculate the total time taken so the aeroplane leaves barcelona at 10 10 pm and then reaches accra at 5 50 am the next morning so from 10 10 pm to 12 am is one hour 50 minutes so we have one hour, 50 minutes, plus, and then from 12 a.m. to 5.50 a.m. is 5 hours, 50 minutes. So plus 5 hours, 50 minutes. Now to find the total time taken, we are going to add these two time values now 50 minutes plus 50 minutes is 100 minutes and then we all know that 60 minutes is equal to one hour therefore if we have 100 minutes then 100 minutes will be one hour 40 minutes okay so we have one hour 40 minutes we are going to add this one plus five so that we have six plus this one hour and then we have seven hours so seven hours and then 40 minutes so this is the total time taken by the aeroplane so we need to convert this time value all to hours now in fraction we are going to have seven hours 40 minutes and then we know that one hour is equal to 60 minutes so divided by 60 20 goes here two times and then here three times so this becomes seven whole number two over three now let's convert this mixed number to improper fraction so this becomes three times seven is 21 plus two is 23 so that is 23 divided by three hours so this is the total time taking now we are going to find the average speed of the aeroplane in kilometers per hour therefore the average speed is given by the total distance covered divided by the total time taken and this is equal to 4415 kilometers divided by 23 over 3 hours so we have 4415 times 3 over 23 and this becomes 
0.8696 kilometers per hour. Now we are asked to leave our answer correct to the nearest whole number. Therefore, we have the average speed to be 576 kilometers per hour. Let's solve the second question. So our next question happens to be NOBDEP 2015, question 6B. There are five more girls than boys in the class. If two boys join the class, the ratio of girls to boys will be 5 is to 4. Find I, the number of girls in the class, II, total number of pupils in the class, III, probability of selecting a boy as the class prefect. Now from the question, we are told that there are five more girls than boys in a class. Now since we don't know the number of boys in the class, we say that let the number of boys be x. So we consider the number of boys to be x. So the number of girls The number of girls will be x plus 5. Now if two boys join the class, the ratio of girls to boys will be 5 is to 4. So if two boys join the class, if two boys join the class, the number of boys The number of boys become x plus 2 and also we are told that the ratio of girls to boys will be 5 is to 4 so the number of girls is x plus 5 is 2 the number of boys after we have two boys joining so x plus 2 and that is equal to 5 is to 4 so we can express this as x plus 5 equals 5 divided by x plus 2 equals 4. So now let's cross multiply. So we have 4 times x plus 5 equals 5 times x plus 2. Now let's multiply across. 4 times x, we have 4x. 4 times 5 is 20. 5 times x is 5x. 5 times 2 is 10. Now we can transpose 10 to the left hand side and then 4x to the right hand side. So we have 20 minus 10 equals 5x minus 4x. So this is 10 equals x. Therefore, x is equal to 10. Now we are asked to find i, the number of girls in the class. And the number of girls in the class was given as x plus 5. Therefore, the number of girls in the class is 10 plus 5 which is equal to 15. Now let's solve for ii. So ii we are going to find the total number of peoples in a class. So to find the total number of peoples in a class, the number of boys The number of boys, boys in the class is x, which is equal to 10. And the number of girls in the class is x plus 5, which is 
10 plus 5 equals 15. Therefore, the number of or the total number of people in the class, the total number of people in the class is 10 plus 15 which is equal to 25 and then for iii we are to find the probability of selecting a boy as the class prefect the probability of selecting a boy as a class prefect so we say that let the event of selecting a boy as the class prefect ba therefore the probability of event e occurring is equal to the number of boys in the class divided by the total number of people in the class now the total number of boys in the class is 10 and the total number of people in the class is 25 therefore the probability of event a occurring is equal to 5 goes here 2 times 5 goes here 5 times so that is 2 over 5 or better still 0.4 so this is the probability of selecting a boy as the class prefect. So that's it for today's video. Thanks for watching and see you in my next video. Bye-bye.